One and all, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, uh, where we are in the beginning of sequence eight right now. As you can see, if you haven't been following recently, we got the Brutus armor. And yes, I did do a little bit of extra to get the Altair sword. Did that off. Uh, off stream. Yes, I did. I admit it. Oh well, what are you going to do? So, uh, we are going to... Where are we going to? Okay. We're going to go there to start the memory. So, it looks like we're going... Vaticano. Vatic... Whatever they call it, yeah. We're going there. That's right. That's what we're doing. That's where we're going. Uh, do, 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 do. Just kind of running around right now. Okay, so hopefully your day's been going well. And I hope that everything is good in your life. Uh, and thank you for joining me for this stream. And, yeah, all right, there we go. Yeah, let's get some business out of the way, yeah? So if you're watching this on Twitch right now, hey, how about a follow? Huh? Follow the channel if you like it. That would be greatly appreciated. If you're watching this on YouTube, hey, click that like button. Little thumbs up icon there. You know, go ahead, click that. Why don't you please? Thank you very much. And, hey, you want more like this? Subscribe to the channel. There's a lot of this. There's a lot of Assassin's Creed stuff right now. Why? Because that's what I'm doing. I am playing through the entire franchise from start to most recent, which that'll put us at Valhalla. Uh, and probably by the time we get to Valhalla, I'll have made my decision on whether or not I want to get the, D the new DLC uh, Ragnarok thing, I think. I, don't, I think that's what it's called, isn't it, Ragnarok? Uh, hold on, i got to adjust my headset here for... A uh, quickie. Uh, yeah. Is it Ragnarok? I think that's what the DLC is. Uh, I haven't made my mind up yet on if I want to do that. I've heard mixed uh, comments on it, reactions, whatever you want to call it. Um, some folks I have talked to have stated it's not worth the cost. Uh, but they're very, they can be very critical on what they uh, like and dislike. So <clears throat> I guess it's, it's just up to the individual, isn't it? Yes. On whether or not you think it's worthwhile. Uh, I if you have that DLC for Valhalla uh, and you've played it, let me know what you think about it <clears throat> in the comments. Or if you're currently viewing the video right now, let me know in the chat uh, as we're going through this. Okay. Um, but yeah, back to the YouTube stuff, uh, click notifications if you want to know when new videos go up. Right now I'm, I'm doing AC Brotherhood, and we're almost done with this, so that means Revelations is just around the corner, you know? Uh, and then also, uh, every Wednesday and Thursday I also do Forza Horizon. Right now we're in Horizon 5. Uh, I'm not doing playthroughs on that from the beginning just because, you know, uh, let's face it, Horizon 1 was very strict in what you could do. Um, Horizon 2, just because I don't have it anymore, I, that was one I got rid of a while ago, and I kind of wish I hadn't because, you know, I almost kind of would, would like to do something like that with Horizon. Uh, these guys here, let's just take them out. Let's just get them out of the equation. Okay, so, yeah. But, yeah, I'm doing uh, Horizon 5 on Wednesdays and Thursdays. I do uh, the end. I end the Horizon week with playing through the uh, day all the daily challenges that I'm able to play through okay I have to say that now because they have reverted back to their old ways in um, what does that mean you say well I'll tell you what that means their old ways of uh, 
discriminating against discriminating against uh, non-premium players. Okay, that is their old ways on the daily challenges. No, I don't. You know, hey, you gotta have your you know your premium setups and stuff like that. I get that. Uh, but I've always been of the belief that your daily challenges uh, should be all-inclusive, okay? You have your festival playlist, and you have certain things that, you know, you put forth for your uh, premium uh, subscribers. I guess you could call that premium subscription people. <coughs> you know, excellent box live gold membership type stuff is what I'm talking about. If you, I don't know if that... That is something that is on Twitch, or not Twitch, up. If that is on, what is it, Steam, or even if it's on the PlayStation Network. I don't know if any of that uh, is Forza. No, wait, Forza is strictly Microsoft, isn't it? So you can't play Horizon on PS, can you? Or have they changed that? I don't know. Anyway, you get what I'm saying, though. Uh, I, th I think the gist is there, right? Uh, so... Anyhow, back back to it. You know, they for a while there they were doing great. Uh, there was no premium type stuff uh, on the daily challenges. They started the game off doing that though, where it would be like you would have two or three of the daily challenges would it be a strictly uh, premium event, whether it be arc doing something in the arcade or doing something with the eliminator. You know, it's just. Uh, yeah, it it got ridiculous. Well, I emailed them and I said, "Hey, look, this is this is the issue." I, want to see the Pope. I said, "Well, you Sporting know, I think you guys are being a little unfair to Get out of my way. all players. It's always been an all-inclusive thing for the daily challenges. I get what you guys want to do, and you know, basically what I just talked about here uh, is what I said in my email uh, and uh, my criticism towards the game." And also how it had made me really dislike the Horizon franchise, which it did. Uh, I was really, you know, I really hated it for a while there. All right, let's switch to crossbow. But, you know, it, it brought me back the for the last, last month brought me back with what they did for the season six. Yeah, series six, not season six. Series six uh, brought me back to it, you know. And I was really, I was really pleased with everything and how it was going. And then all of a sudden, you know, I'm going through looking at what Series 7 is bringing us. And I'm seeing, oh, we're back to our old ways. And that kind of bummed me out. And I was like, well, all right, fine. I guess we'll go back to uh, emailing them and whatnot. If that even worked the first time, I don't know. Maybe it, maybe it didn't. Well, obviously it didn't if they went back to their old ways, right? Okay. So we get, we're going to have to do something with this fella up here. Kind of boogity boogity over here. He's going to come this way, so we might as well take him out. Where does it come? There you are. Thank you. Goodbye. See you next fall. All right. Um, oh, oh, oh. Bugger that. He's looking at me goofy. Sorry. You looked at me sideways. Uh, so, yeah. Anyhow, back to the Assassin's Creed because that is what we're playing. That is what you're here for. You're here for the Creed. You're here for Ezio. Well, maybe you're not here for Ezio. Maybe you've never played as Ezio before. You don't know what it's all about. And if you haven't, wow. I'm sorry. But I'm glad you're here. I'm glad that you found this channel. And hopefully this kind of leads you into playing this game uh, from the beginning. You know, you go back to Altair with the original Assassin's Creed. You know, I mean, there, there's deals on that everywhere you go, probably. Uh, on I know on X Live you can get there you can get the Ezio trilogy in a bundle. Uh, I don't know uh, for the original AC what is available on that, but I know that there at one time there was a bundle. 
that gave you Assassin's Creed 1 th through 3. Okay, so that would give you the original with Altair. It gives you the Ezio Trilogy. It then will give you um, the Assassin's Creed 3 game with Connor. Yes, that's exactly what it would do. Yes. Okay. Yes. I don't understand. I ordered a fresh batch of. So here we go. All right, we're gonna have to get up I into that hole. Sorry, I was kind of going off on a little thing there, but uh. Where is the Pope? He meets with Cesare. Strange. This is, is probably this uh, return. the Brotherhood game is probably one of the most widely loved woman gives me so Assassin much. Creed Why games of all time. What a Why is that? Has. You might ask if you are not familiar with this franchise. Well, I'll tell you why. Many, many, many things. <clears throat> Number one, because Ezio here, our, uh, our protagonist, uh, he's very, you know, he's very uh, pleasing to people. Uh, Assassin's Creed 2 came out, I think, combined with his charm and the addition of the second hidden blade... Uh, that really got us fans who weren't even really expecting that. It got us all talking, and we were like, wow, you know, I loved the first one, but the second one just blew my mind away. Ooh, got lucky on that. You know, and so that's where, you know, the, f the, the, uh, the liking, the loving of Ezio came into play. And... Uh, from that, okay, from that game, AC2, we continued on with the Ezio saga. Now, obviously, they had always intended to do the Ezio trilogy because, you know, they, they don't just work on one game and then start up a next game after they release one game. So when they were when they were working on this game, they were also working on brotherhood and revelations okay so when this game was released you had multiple um i didn't want to do that anyhow you had multiple games being made at the time okay and but back to why th this particular game stands out um, um, amongst all these games is because this was the introduction of multiplayer play okay uh, and of course that's something that you need uh, Xbox Live Gold for for me uh, and for you out there going well why don't you have the gold well I'll tell you why I don't have the gold when they stopped doing multiplayer on AC that is when I stopped doing gold on Xbox Live because I I wasn't going to do anything other than this and if you know and some of the Horizon stuff but you know and they stopped doing the multiplayer with Black Flag maybe no it would have been um, Rogue yeah it would have been Rogue because Unity they kind of put it in game uh, so it would have been because Unity was supposed to be the, uh, the, what, wow, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, it was supposed to have been the beginning of the, the new generation of Assassin games, right? But because it did what it did, because they rushed it, let's face it, they rushed it. You know, they, they got a little cocky with it a little bit. And it was rushed. Plain and simple. There's no two ways about that. Actually, we're going to do the uh, poison darts for this spot. We'll wait till he comes back and turns his back to us. <coughs> and then we'll go up. There he is right there. Select him. Missed him. Shoot. Missed him again. Son of a... Biscuit. So we gotta wait for him to do. Okay, fine. 
you're going to be that way. And then I'm going to do it this way. We're going to switch back. All right, there he goes. There is another guard over here somewhere that might spot us. Uh, I don't. Where is he? I don't. I hope he doesn't spot me. But anyhow, you just kind of. There we go. We're going to wait for him to come back. Then we're going to ledge assassinate him. Up. Over he goes. Over we go. There's this guy here. Switch to your crossbow. Take him out. Easy peasy, right? Yes, it is. Uh, but, yeah, with the addition of multiplayer... <coughs> You know, it really added a, f a great, fun element to this game uh, for the masses. I mean, it was so new uh, to be doing stuff like that with a char the multiple characters and whatnot. Alright, what am I doing here? This is what I'm doing. Come on. Would you just do what I want you to do? Please. Now, uh, hopefully I don't regret not taking out the uh, guards on the rooftops. I'm hoping I don't regret that, but you never know. We'll just reach over and grab that. Go down. Okay. You know, so we, I mean, we got a lot of games over the years with that multiplayer function. And... What has happened here? It made online playing a lot of fun because uh, there were various oh. different games with it, Financial and you could, you know, you could you could do your style, and you go up against other people. You could mimic or um, I do not. change the way you look and, and all that stuff. So, uh, if you ever have the chance the to do it, and I don't necessary. know if they're still the servers are still that active uh, for it, I don't think they are. They are might be for Black Flag or Rogue. I'm not 100% no. sure. Did you uh, if you know the answer to that, let me know in the chat right now or let Was me know in the comments there on YouTube. Uh, yeah. Not have to stand for this. So. The assassins murdered him. Why did you not stop and this is, I mean, this is the second game for Ezio. It was not my decision to attack Monterigione. It was yours. This is, you know, there's Rodrigo Borgia. He's the Pope. It That's his son, Cesare, if you haven't been following for along. Your actions. My These are actual people from history. The That's the beauty of, and I think a lot of the attraction like of these early games uh, is anyway. the seamless interjection out of, my of the assassins into historical... Cesare! Events, uh, if that makes sense, okay? Uh, you had Rodrigo Borgia, who became a pope. He was, I can't remember, uh, Pope something the sixth, I believe he was. Alexander the sixth, maybe? Uh, I think it was something like that. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, but he, he, was a, he was a piece of garbage, all right? He really was. He was a power-hungry... Arse. And there die, were rumors about his children having incest with one another. Uh, Cesare and Lucrezia. That, that's been historically... I don't know if it's documented or rumored or... It is what it is. There you go. But they, they took actual historical events, historical people from that period, and they inserted the assassins into into that story and i think that's what really grabs a hold of people you know uh and they really did a number on ac3 even though ac3 in my opinion is a little too preachy when it comes to the uh, war of independence for uh for us here in the states uh it, it gets uh, way too, um, oh, jeez, old Pete's. Give me the apple. That was, uh, mine, not yours. that was, uh, uh, I want the apple. 
pucker moment there, wasn't it? Now we got to get back up here. All right. I need... Okay, I do have my... Uh, I do have my crossbow available. I'm just going to take these guys out. There we go. All right. Fine. There we go. We're taking out guys left and right. All right. And that can get annoying there if you don't get to it quickly, but... I am not in any hurry at this moment. I'm just going to come over here. There it is right here. Just come over the edge. Climb down as far, or if you want to go fast, you could just drop. But, like this, there you go. Then you come in here. Oh, it's a shame Ezio didn't get to do it, isn't it? Just because, you know, he orchestrated the death of Ezio's father and two brothers. Okay. Okay, so back to St. Pietro we go. St. Peter's is where we're headed, okay? We're going to go back out. Well, no, we aren't going to go back out the way we came. we got to go this way. Uh, can I do the window? All right, no, I can't. What is that? Wow. Okay, fine. I gotta go up. Because this window should be closed by now. Yes, that window is closed, so we're gonna go this way. I don't think it matters which way I go, just as long as I can go up. Oh, can't go that way. Oh, that's a pain in the arse. How about this way? Can't go that way? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. How the hell am I gonna get out of here? Huh? Okay, I guess we're going down. What about if I go this way? There is a... There was a secret exit or entrance somewhere around here. I don't know. I don't know if it's available at this point. But there was, at one point... No, it's sealed off. Yeah. Well, I tried. Okay, that's the way we came in. All right, so that's the way we come on. All right. Oh, there we got to go. All right, there it is. He locks us in somehow, and then we go back another way. Okay, there we go. I will come for you. All right. All right, Cesare, off you go. There we go. All right, I knew there was something that I was missing. All right, so we got to go up the stairs, jump, and then we'll come back down this way. So you run up here, get on that, back eject, then you can make this up, over, boom, boom. Up we go here, down he goes, wasting no time. Oh, this is, yeah, this is where I'm thinking I was going. Is he yet? Okay, there is treasure up here too, if I remember. Yes. See that door right there is what take. There is that door that takes you. Uh, at some point in the game, I, if I remember right, it takes you to uh, the prisoner area. All right, there goes Cesare. He's boogity in. We're going all the way over to that big dome area. So what we do is you're going to go up this way. Okay. Now, uh, yes, uh, you have people alerted to your presence, but you can get, if you get up here quick, no worries. Now, because I already cleared out this area, there's only a couple guards up that way. So, not going to take much to clear those guys out. 
He's done. I'm not going to waste my time um, looting him just because we are on the clock here. Okay. This is where the climbing glove comes in really handy. Just all the way up here. That way you don't have to do the spin around the ropes. And we're just going to go straight up the top. We're going to get the feather. Or is that a flag? Borgia flag on the top of the... Of course it is. Now, that's where we're going. So you want to jump off and hit your chute. That's why you have to complete the Leonardo da Vinci War Machines. All four of them because that's what you get to your chute. And you just... It's pretty simple, easy, really, to go. And then you, you get a good line of sight of where you're going, right? You can get a good idea on where to go. And where the guards are on the map. And on the rooftops. So you just kind of, you know, they're going to shoot at you. Don't worry about them. They're gonna, there you go, and then you can just keep dropping. Alright, these guys. I don't really have time to screw with these guys all that much. In fact, I'm not going to. I'm gonna get out of there. Because I don't have time. We're just going to run. We're going to have to fight him anyhow. Okay, here we go. Running this way. They aren't on me, so I'm all right. Now it's gonna, you're going to get here, and then you're going to want to use your eagle vision. It's on the other side of the... Uh, the big egg thingy here. It's on the other side. But you need your eagle vision to identify it. At least I thought it was on the other side. Where is it? It's over here somewhere. Alright. Well, what am I doing here, folks? Uh, there we go. Press B to interact. Alright, now we're good. And there's the apple. And you here comes Cesare. For this. It ends now, assassino. No, My we actually we actually know how to use the apple, buddy. So I think you you probably should check on your poisoning there. And boom, boom. See ya. Of course, you don't get to do anything other than... It says don't lose any health, but you're going to lose health. If you activate the apple, you lose health. It's simple as that. Uh, where's my exit here? There it is. I mean, I'm going to try best I can to get out of here without losing health. I doubt I'm going to be able to succeed at it, but we're going to give it a try. Yeah. So far, so good. I'm liking this so far, folks. Oh, worry. I thought I had it for a second there, but... Apparently not. Okay. All right, we're doing all right here. So you want to kind of stay to the side and outskirts. There's more guys right here. You got some runners. There, I had to do it. Otherwise, I was going to be in trouble with it. You know what I'm saying? You had to do it. You don't want to go all the way down to nothing, but you, I did. 
and it just takes it out of you like that to where you're stunned as well. All right, I'm just headed for the water. So all I'm doing is I'm going right for this water and I'm going in it. And I am swimming my tuchus all the way over as fast as I can. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay, so there you go. And we are full on notoriety there, so that's never a good thing, is it? No, it really isn't, but it is what it is. You know, I really wish they would have made the uh, Brutus armor available so much sooner in this game. So here we go. They're all going to have a meeting. And Cesare? Well, Cesare is not dead just yet, Machiavelli. We must not allow him to assemble his remaining supporters. The coming weeks are critical. So here we go. You are aid. I will hunt him down. There you go. Time to hunt him down. But we might need an army. We have one. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> so you got to take out Cesare's army. Not, I mean, it is what it is. It's one of the few downsides of this game is the end of this game, you know. It is... Just because I, it's all you get to use. It's, it's all you can use. You can't use anything else. I would love to use my sword and everything like that to take people out, but I can't. You have to use the apple to uh, do it. You don't have assassins to call in for a, a arrow storm. They are everywhere and nowhere at once. So it is what it is. You just gotta we cannot on our own, gut senor. through it, so you to speak. I am ill, you idiot. Okay, so he's still poisoning, or poisoned. He's still poisoning himself. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Okay. <clears throat> Whoops. I found you. I found you. Okay, here we go, gentlemen. You really want... You really want some of this? All right, we'll just take these guys out right there. I need to get these guys over here. They're fighting each other. Come on. Back to full health. All right, here we go. I want to get those guys in the mix. Okay, and then I'm going to go over by this guy here who is kneeling okay. Fine. I'm going to shoot him. All right, there we go. This guy. All right, there we go. We got that checkpoint. Thank goodness. 100% sink. It, easy. I mean, there is no, there is no uh, objective to get 100%. All you got to do is do it. And you get 100%. So there you go. On to the next section. You just got to keep doing it. Uh, the Cardinal there we go. Under stress that yeah. Cesare plans to meet with Templar loyalists in the countryside. There we go. That's where we're going to go next. Tonight. I will follow him. Okay. So there you go. Uh, you're going to follow... And then he's going to hook up, and then we're going to do some more arse kicking. And, of course, we're, we're as notoriably, or no, there's, oh, we got notoriety up the yin yang. It just annoys me that we've got so much notoriety, but what can you do about it? There's nothing I can do about it. Uh, do can I get it? I can. All right. <clears throat> I'm gonna take time to do that. Can I do my pigeon coop as well and assign some assassins since I can't use my own? Wonderful. Might as well take the time. If you can't use them, might as well use them elsewhere, right? 
Exactly. All right, so, oh, and of course they're locked. Isn't that just the way it is? That just, that, that sucks. It really, really, really sucks. Okay, there, see, the gold. So you're gonna run over there. Should cut scene it, or. I mean, there we go. Took me a second to, all right. So he's gonna run off and do his thing and you're just gonna trail him. Uh, is he gonna ride a horse? Don't know. No, he's not riding a horse. All right. But he's gonna sit there and watch. I think he's gonna go into the Coliseum. I think. Uh, so I'm gonna do this. Oh my gosh, mercenaries, do your damn job. Oh wait, I'm out of the apple situation? Oh, lovely. No weapon nor tool may use while holding it. Oh crap. Kind of zoom past those guys. We gotta get, oh, I'm, there he is, okay. Wonderful cutscene. here we go. Cesare is talking to the church Join people. <clears throat> we have decided to elect Della to the There you go. He wanted we them to so make him pope. I paid for your appointment. And no, they did not. not. The same as it once was. They kind of Borja money has become tainted. Stabbed him in you the back. This decision. Assassino. Run! Yes. I have men promise you their blood. Oh, as soon as you need shame. help, they turn against you. God! Yeah. Okay, what do we got here? We got... Alright. I want to make sure that we get the main guys. There, we got Aerostorm back at least. This guy's running over here. Drive them a little bit mad and bonkers I'm gonna move around and there you go get him right next to you get him in the white and then release unfortunately I didn't have a whole lot of health I love how he's, he's holding that like he's a massive firearm right All right, they're all fighting him, and they're all going to go about. All right, I'm back to full health, so I can come right up and do this. <clears throat> Just so I don't... What the heck? All right, this guy here, where are you running, dude? All right, we gotta go full on with him. All right, now we got more. There we go. I'm gonna kind of. What the heck, man? All right, let's see what happens. All right, they're all gonna fight amongst themselves, I hope. <clears throat> I want this guy here. All right, come on. This is the last one I've got. You're right next to me, so I'm taking you out. There, he's done. Checkpoint reached. See what I'm saying though about you know having to use the apple. It's it's very, eh. You know it's no fun. 
It's just a pain in the arse. All right, 15:30 December. Here we go. We're at the barracks. My men tell me Cesare's best soldiers in front of the main gate into Roma. All right, this Gather is going to be facing together. The battle with the assassins. The whole brotherhood's going to come out for this one. Uh, as far as, you know, the main characters like Claudia, Bartolomeo, La Volpe, um, Machiavelli. They all jump in the mix, you know. So we're going here. Fine. You know what, guys? You, you just shouldn't have bothered me. Maybe I make him go crazy. I don't know. Now, finish him. No, don't finish me. Who do you think you're messing with? There we go. All right, Arrow Storm is available. Let's do this. So if you play your cards right you get right up on them really quick the first wave and take them out with arrow storm but you shall be dead before then okay so here we go see I just run right to the middle of it and then you should be able to get most of them with arrow storm right off the bat Second wave will come in really quick, though. All right, you just got to fight for about... See the counter right there? We're going to hire the mercs. They're going to get in on it. We're going to come over here, help Bartolomeo out. Okay, that guy, he's a little scaredy cat right there. Uh, let's, help, let's help our sister out, shall we? Take that out, okay. All the while, Arrow Storm is charging. Just come right over here. There's that, okay. <clears throat> now, we got Luke, okay. Cesare's on the other side. He's gonna brag a little bit. Because here comes the papal army, right? Right? Well, if you remember back to when we first met uh, Machiavelli. This is not your city anymore. Here we go. That's his cousin, I think. It's somebody's cousin. Is it Bartolomeo's cousin, maybe? No! Yeah, anyhow, he's in charge of the papal guard, so there you go. Oh, sucks to be you, Chesare. Off you go. I will not die by the hands of man. There you go. Okay, well, maybe not. We'll see what happens. And that is going to be that for Chesare for the time being. Chains will not hold me. Uh, you are so worried. There is a way we will see. No, it is too powerful. I think I think I'm gonna end it in the morning a tomorrow. Hiding a masterpiece where no one will ever see it. Uh. But what if he meant? I think. And then tomorrow night we'll. Uh, what is wait? What are? It. What is today? Monday. <clears throat> so today's Monday. So Tuesday we'll finish Brotherhood and start Revelation. I, was right. I, have to leave. I think what that's fair. I built this Brotherhood to last. With uh, unless we finish this right now, that is. Hmm. Here, I'm gift. thinking. If this is goodbye, then keep your money. I do not want it. We will see each other again. You have my word. Because it takes a it takes a little bit to get through this final sequence. Um, Take the money. On your meager salary, you will need it. My friend has been arrested after all. Let me think, let me think what I'm doing here. That's sequence 8 right there. Uh, do I do sequence 9? I don't know. 
hundred percent, whatever. Sequence eight complete. I could I could either go through sequence nine real quick. No, I, because it's not that quick. Come to think of it, it's not that quick. Uh, there's actually a little bit to it, so I think I'm gonna hold off and I'm gonna do sequence nine, the finale tomorrow morning. And uh, then we will start Revelations tomorrow evening. I think that's not a bad little, uh, not a bad little schedule to do right there, you know? Okay, so, crap. Maybe we go straight into it now? All right, fine, we'll go straight into it. Where are we at time-wise? I'm at 45 minutes on the stream. So fine, I guess I'll do it. Can I do Tell this in 15 minutes? Uh, I don't know if I can get this done in 15 minutes. Somebody make a move. Somebody else make a move. Oh, there we go. Well, somebody made a move and blew us right up. <clears throat> so, okay, here we are. Via, uh, Viana, March of 1507. So this is four years after uh, the previous sequence, okay? Sequence 9, the fall. I've got my Altair sword. I need munitions. Oh. Why am I doing that? I want to loot. I don't want to carry. Alright. Throwing knives are full. Poison's full. Bolts are full. Where's my, uh, what is my medicine at? Medicine is full. Everything's full. So why am I looting? No reason. We're going to travel by horse. Yes. Okay, so here we go. You're only going to be on the horse for so long because you're going to get shelled. And the horse is going to, unfortunately, for you animal lovers out there, especially you horse lovers, uh, the horse gets it. Uh, unfortunately. See? The horse gets it. You're not on the horse that long. So why they put it there, I don't know. It's just... Oh, well. So now it's just a matter of sprinting through. I'm not really going to get distracted by anybody. Uh, however, I am dealing with multiple bogeys. So... Somebody else make a move, not this guy. guy with the the longest weapon got to get dirty and throw dirt you know I mean really all right oh hey look at he just magically jumped over to me all right I got my medicine back all right fine I'm gonna loot this and be on my way all right we're just gonna go this way avoid everybody it's it's kind of a shortcut but you know as long as you can get around them does it really matter how I do it you know what I'm saying there we go I mean as long as we get to where we're gonna get it doesn't matter how I get there that's the question the answer is no it does not now this goes to show what kind of guy Cesare is. You know, tells his boys to take, murder the poor woman. Why did you do that? She's an innocent. That's not nice. No bueno. 
Here, take the upper. Just take the upper path. I mean, yeah, okay. It's shameful to ignore the people that are getting slaughtered below you, but at the same time, you know, I just don't want to get caught up in this. You know, I mean, just don't get caught up in it. All right, fine. We want to become anonymous. You want me to be anonymous? I'll be anonymous. Somebody make a move on me, and you're going to go down. There we go. We're back to being anonymous. Now we got to climb the siege tower. This gets a little bit goofy because the camera gets screwy. See what I'm saying? The camera is a little... Stop it. Got to go slow. Up we go. All right, we're going to go up this way. Come on. See? What I'm saying is how screwy it gets here. What What is going on? Oh, I see what I'm doing wrong. Guess what? I'm on the wrong side of the ladder. That's what I was doing wrong on that one. So it wasn't screwy. It was me. Ah! How you like them apples? Okay. Down you go. Now we gotta just go this way, so just kind of run and gun straight. God bless it, you guys are killing me here. Oh, you dirty. Somebody make a move. Somebody else make a move. Why they're fighting each other, I don't know, because they're on the same side. You're done. See you. Bye. Get out of my way. I'm, I'm on a mission, and you're in my way. This gets me out of the fighting zone for a bit. All right. Where am I going? Can I get there from there? No, I can't. Oh, you dirty son of a! All right. This is where I want. Become anonymous. Fine. Would you guys hurry up and get to me? What the? Fine. Jeez, oh, Pete. See, that's the thing is I know where to go, and I'm getting ahead of the game, and the game's not catching up with me. That's the problem we are having. Yes? Yes. But fortunately, we're getting to the end of it. I just got to keep an eye on my health. Up we go. What are you doing? Come on. Climb, son. Up and over. Straight on up. Come on. Come on. You'll get there soon enough. Yes. Got people falling down. All right. Now, take him out. And of course, you know, I just saved your ass, but guess what? You're going to attack me. That's not very neighborly. I mean, come on, these guys. What is up with that, right? So I'm just going to see if I can bring my medicine number back and it doesn't look like I'm going to get my medicines that I want. I'll just do these three. If if I get what I get, I get what I get. I know that just made no sense, but yeah. Hey, we got one medicine back. Fine. So be it. Let's just go do this and get over it. Get it over with. So you're going to take on Cesare now and you'll have a few button tapping segments 
And in between that, you'll get other guys. I cannot die. Fortuna will not kill me. Other guys that. Uh, fighter who you, ever lived. You, there we go. See the button tapping going on? There you go. You, you're going to take off parts of his. If you stay on the attack on him, I mean. See? There you go. Getting his armor off him. Now you get a. If you can get a kill streak going. That's the best way to go on these guys. Yeah, see, a nice little kick. Nice little kick and follow that up with a hit. You're good. There you go. My deflect is not working. What the heck, dude? Get off me. There we go. Oh, you're done pissing me off, Desiree. Come on, I'm almost got you. I almost got you. There it is. Whew. I don't know about you, but my forearms are burning after that. Of course, I didn't work out today, so it didn't. And it was an arm day, so. What do you know? That was a that was a good forearm set, though. I will lead mankind into a new world. So we see just how disillusioned Cesare is. He believes the hype. You cannot kill me. But you're no, no Vegeta, dude, so you're not the height. Then I leave you in the hands of fate. All right, he's not going to kill him. He's just going to toss him. Because Cesare said he cannot die by men. So Ezio just left it to fate. You can just die by gravity. How about that? There you go. What a lovely end to a lovely the villain. Was mine. Okay. Oh, I did what forget, though. Know? There is a part of the end of this that we haven't done yet. I will lead uh, mankind into a new world. And that is the final part of the game, which leads us into the future. So that wouldn't you be a bad step for no tomorrow morning, man maybe. Murder me. So we're going to listen to him spout off a little bit more as we get here. And then you will will see a cut scene of Ezio going back where he puts the apple and it tells them in the present day uh, where the apple is. So there he goes. He put the apple away. Well, where is he? I know where he is. If you've played the game, you know where he is. If you haven't played the game, I'm not going to spoil it for you. So we'll just, we'll just let you see it, okay? So there you go. There's the uh, same pyramid symbol we saw at the beginning in Monterey Joni. And oh, looky here. Where is that? Oh, it looks familiar. We've been there a few times, haven't we? Yes. None other than the Colosseum itself is where he hid it away. So we get to go there in present day and we get to free run through the Colosseum. And Got yeah. It. Coliseum. Let's go. We can be there before dawn. Wait, there was something about that door. I don't think I saw it. Now they gotta figure it out. Blah blah blah. Great. So we blah, need blah, some blah. Kind of future. Skip skip skip. Key. It seems to open with a verbally triggered mechanism. I I've yeah. never seen anything like it. You mean it needs a password? Yeah, it needs Try a password. Way to way to figure that one out, Luce. Damn European power grid. 
Now we can't scan Ezio's memories to find the password. Okay. So checkpoint is reached. We have to find that password. Ezio knows the answer. Problem is, he's dead. Okay. I can't believe we're stuck here. Go this way. Go up here. Back to the door. Use your eagle vision. Once we get to the top. There you go. There you go. Hey, maybe it has something to do with this. There you go. See, Desmond's a bright boy. Isn't he? Right? Symbol matches okay. the one on the door to the vault. Wow. 1490. They're observing. 14, 20, 14, 21. Okay. What if they aren't dead? We're just gonna 14, do it. 19. I'm just 14, doing this. 20. I'm not playing around. Oh my god. So we'll start. What? We'll start with Revelations God. tomorrow. Tell us already. I am. I am. I am. The Tetragrammaton. The 72 there names go. of God. No, you got you see? it. No, you They're got all contained it. within three verses. Sean, Exodus you're 19, so excitable, though. And get this, you'll like this. If you arrange the four yeah. Hebrew letters in God's name within an equilateral triangle, well, then there you go. the values add up to the same number. 72. Are you absolutely sure about this? Yeah. That's kind of why I'm saying it out loud, Rebecca. Yeah, but I haven't got... He's just a yet. snide little fella, isn't he? On the Colosseum began in the year 72. There you go. I it's all that. connected. Sean, go get Don't the you love how that all works out? It all fits, doesn't it? Fits nicely with a nice little bow and everything. So here we go. We're getting in the van. We're going to go to the Colosseum. Awkward drive. Bad shift. And here's the Coliseum modern day. Well, 2012 modern day. Because that's basically the modern day in this game. I bet. Let's All right. Go. So here we go. Well, what about us, hey? You might actually need a historian down there. Sean's right. That tunnel should lead under Capitoline Hill. There you I'll go. I'll help them find another entrance. Be careful, Desmond. All right, so here we go. Ah, yeah, Hopefully nice we can get That's through this car. pretty seamlessly. Okay. Down you go, and here we go. Basically, it's, it's a pretty uh, straightforward, I think, route, if I'm not mistaken. You know, it's been a while, but I think, yeah... I think it's a straightforward route. Lucy, I'm making my way toward the entrance. Okay, good. He see any gladiators? All right, here my we go. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. All right. All right. That way? Yes. Okay. Just kind of zigzagging through. All right, we come over here. Looks like we got to... Oh, no, right here. That looks like a thing to do yeah or maybe we'll just go this way I can't believe I'm actually gonna there we go up. all right I wonder if it'll change things so swing, swing around in our favor. second swing around it has to. all right uh, we're gonna go right up the top of here back eject here free run here what do you think we'll find Hopefully a map to the Alright. The apple's just gonna give it to us, is it? Yeah. Right, we're gonna go oh, this way. Hey, up maybe here. this time we'll be lucky. I think I'm going the right route. I hope I'm going the right route. Okay, so then we're gonna go oh yeah, I see it. Yep. We're going the right way. So you go up here and you gotta shuffle over to this through here. Like this. Right there. There's so much construction. This place is like a maze. Well, but yeah, I that's the whole point of it. Alright. We're doing alright, I think. Yeah, doing okay. Good to Everybody's know. sticking with me on this. Alright, wonderful. Obviously, we gotta. 
Okay, can't do that. How about this? There we go. There's our up. And we're going to back eject here. Shuffle over here. Back eject there. See? I'm making good off. time. Today's date is October 10th. All right. Making really good time. So, guess how many days there are until the Templar satellite launch? 72. I have a feeling I know the answer. 72. Why is today so important? There we go. We're just picking up the apple and leaving. Yeah. It's the door code. Take the. Someone wants to make sure we get it right. Lift. Yes, yes. Over here. Over here. Oh, you're getting a little crazy on me here, Desmond. You're getting a little Arno-ish. <sighs> oh, it wouldn't be a stream unless I put the digs to okay, Unity. Okay. There we go. There. Press any button, and there's usually two, so you just, once you do that, you can do that, right? There you go. All right. So that'll spin the door open, and you got to do it the rest of the way. And there's a couple of those like that. That's why when we were down here, or in an area with that same statue as Ezio, I, I was confused on, hey, do I have to do something right here? Because I remembered that part of it. But I was remembering this part of the game. Thinking it was that part of the game. Get me? I hope so. Because sometimes I don't. Okay, so. Here's Juno. Not Minerva. Minerva was the last one. We leave behind. Who are you? There you go. That one's Juno. We saw Minerva at the end of the last game. Checkpoint is reached. Just climb up here. Pick a side. They both go to the same direction. Shuffle, shuffle. Up you go. Just free run. Whoops. Can I make that jump? No, I can't. Shoot. All right, so we got to go back here. I must have missed something. My bad. My bad. All right, I think I can get up. Nope. All right, fine. Be that way. Yep. Backside. What are we doing here, kids? Come on, you're killing me. All right. Shuffle. Now I'm going to have to do this slow. Fine, I'll do it slow. Over to this beam. Over to this beam. I see what I didn't do. Yeah. So we're going to go here. There you see. All right. So don't make the mistake I did and try to quick swing through, you know? Yeah. I realized it when I did it that I wasn't going to make it. There you go. In you go. And then we come up to another one of these. In the beginning, we set our There's that. There's that. Okay. To the memory of Nen. There's that These one. Impermanent things. Cleansed by fire. Over here, we're Cleansed good. And then it'll crack the door. All in the we'll go. Innocent once more. Innocent and ignorant. You can stop and listen to Juno if you want to. Looks like she's done talking anyhow. Ooh, a bit tired there, eh? Yeah, a bit of a yawn. Okay, so... Looks like we go right there. To that. Back eject. Right into that. And it takes us up into this nice, beautiful area. How beautiful is that? We'll let them in the door, and then we've got to do some free running up top and some uh, to activate a switch at the very tippity top area. So they come in. Took you long enough. What is this place? Santa Maria and Aquelli. 
See okay. those columns along the aisles? They're lifted from Roman ruins. Now, supposedly, this church was built so on go top up. of the ancient temple of Juno. There's a switch over there that I saw straight Light ahead. Shimmering. Hey, you, know, oh, you are a fascinating traveling companion. All right. So, get done with the cutscene, and there we go. I'm just going to go this way. I think we go this way. I'm not 100% sure, but I think this is the way to go. Maybe? Is it? Or do I have to go that way? Uh. Jeez, I don't remember. Where to now? There's something up oh, there. Oh, there we go. We follow Ezio's lead. Follow his lead. Oh, oh, we'll just stay down here then, shall we? There you go. Thank you, Ezio, for showing the way. I really appreciate that. Up to that switch, and that will activate everything else. Right? I think. Yes. Am I happy? Am I doing good? I'm doing good. There, that lowers. That's where we got to get to to get that switch. And then the course in which to get to that switch is made available to us. So you see what you got to do. So we're going to go over to this. And you're going to free run here to here to there. Okay. Jump up on that. Back eject up to that. To and now they boom, are boom. A lot of back ejecting on this seg segment of the course. But also, when you do back eject, make sure you get to the top of those. Uh, what would you call those? Little danglies. There. Just in case you fall, you now got a ladder up. Isn't that nice? Something's open. There we go. And then we're just going to kind of jump up. Most, not all. Swing and uh, around. Alright. Scoot over here. Place. Eternal. To store objects. Words. Jump over Wisdom. there. But not life. Okay. Almost did we have the means. Now, go to this. Time. Climb up, Time like I said, to that. Then we're going to back eject. And then you're going to go all the way to this. We can see back eject again. Get back right. up high. His reach is so very long. His right there. Back unending. eject. We now, if you do this, you should be able forever. to back eject from there. There you go. And just do what Ezio's doing. Here goes. And then you just get to swing on down. There's that. Wasn't in the blueprints. Desmond, get down here. On my way. See, you get some, you get some marky, m m marky bars. No, monkey bars. Swing, bada bada bada. So wing. No. This is, it doesn't do All right, anything. so we're just gonna walk up to this. Any button, once again, that's our favorite thing in the I'm present so day. Sure. Any button, because it's attuned to his DNA. Because, like Neo in the Matrix, Desmond is the one. <laughs> he is. Boy, that would kind of freak you out, wouldn't it? How the hell are you going to get out, you'd say to yourself. If you, if you want to kill us, mate, you're going to have to try a little harder than that. Yeah. Everybody have a heart We're attack here. on that one. All right, now we get to go down into the catacombs area. Little pathway over there, pretty straightforward and simple. I'm always right. About that dead end. That never happened. I was misquoted. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. You just go down, uh, up and over here. You say the 72, it speaks English? and Just then see. behind you will okay. open the uh, door. 72. And look at that. How wonderful is that? Hey, hey, cool. Groovy. And here's the doorway.
All right, and off we go. Just gonna run on down into here. You guys have to see this. And that's where the apple is straight across. So now what you have to do is go the course to get to the apple. Okay. And I believe it's the ones where the power is. All right. So you go down to here. This will activate it. All right. So you see how it's glowing on the left peg. If you hit all of them, you might get some power to the central platform. There's power on the left switch. Okay, we want power to the right. Is what I'm thinking. A hundred years I might speak, and still you would not know us. You with five senses. No, I think this is the way to go. The one we kept from you to be safe. Yeah, that's now the way to go. So, the one that's lit up. Oh, at our not at zero. Freaking Desmond. Uh, okay, here we go. All right, let's try this again. Not to go too crazy with it. Did I just turn it off? I don't know what I did. Okay. All right. Up this over here. Right. And we're going to jump to that. See, it's just kind of going in circles around each of these things. Over to this. Okay. And we come here. Now, After again, we see where the power earth, is. Try to pass it through the blood. Try to join you to us. You see the blue shimmer. You hear the words. There you go. Just gotta stay with it. It is hard to stay contained. Just follow it. It leads you through it quite easily. It's just you, making sure that you, you stay. You will activate it. You will know only when it is too late. Did you and hear any of that? It leads you back to the group up there. Just like that. Okay. There we go. Not too bad, I only fell once. We get the ramp across. And here we are. The ominous words, you'll know when it's only when it's too late. So you go here. And here we are. You want me to ask it? Or think it or something. Okay. Grab it. See what happens. Grab it. You sure you asked it the right thing? I know this. I know this. Yeah. That, that's a Phrygian cap. Okay, so there you go. Uh, and that, that's a Masonic we're wrapping it up and here on Brotherhood. And somebody was lighting I, I me up move. on my... Your DNA there you go. Apple. You have activated it. Let me go. Oh, all right. All right. Here we go. Okay. So she's talking about Lucy. And the apple is making him do this. So there's no fighting it, so you might as well just do it. You can't fight it. So. Stop, please. You know very little. We must guide you. Yeah, just kind of go to it. Go with it. Yeah, don't struggle. 
Just do it. Just do it. No. You gotta take her out. You gotta do it, Desmond. We gotta end this stream, so you gotta do it. Just take her out. Press any button, and there you go. It She's toast. Done. It is done. The way lies all before you. All right. Only she remains to be found. Awaken the six. Go alone. And they're out. Just like that. Okay, so that brings us to the end of Brotherhood. What a wonderful trip it was. What a wonderful game it is. If you have not played it yourself, I urge you to play this game. Because it's a great game. All right, I urge you to play all the Assassin games from start, you know, from the very beginning at As Assassin's Creed as Altair and work your way through just like we're doing here on the stream. Okay, I really appreciate you uh, stopping by and watching this video. If you haven't subs or if you haven't followed me yet on Twitch, please do that. Same thing with on YouTube. If you haven't liked this video, then like it now. If you haven't subscribed to that YouTube channel, subscribe now you know what are you waiting for i mean you're gonna do it eventually right maybe i hope so it'd be nice if you did i'd appreciate it i appreciate you you know and hey if just so you know when these videos get uploaded to youtube click that notification so you're going to be one of the first if not the first to know Shit, you very well could be yeah I'm, say, I'm saying i'm but saying uh any comments are always not. welcome uh, any feedback, oh. any input, hey, I'm always open to it. Okay? And, yeah, as always, please treat all those you encounter with kindness, dignity, and respect. And until next time, ta-ta.